Right, the Cottonwood Bears are undefeated this year, coming off of a bye week, and they're hosting the Ayrton Purple Cats, who are coming off of two straight wins and knocking off another undefeated team in Strawn. The two teams square off tomorrow in our Extra Point Game of the Week. They're a very good football team. Their record does not show um, the caliber team that they have. They're a great football team. They've been in the playoffs uh, the last several years and, uh, and have a lot of players back that got them there last year. So they're a really good football team. And again, they're well coached, they're disciplined. Uh, we expect uh, a great game against those guys. And these Bears are coming out of hibernation, or should I say the bye week while it has its advantages, these guys got to make sure they stay focused. It's good and bad, you know, we got to rest up and get our energy and everything back together and recover our bodies, but it can also mess you up because you're not ready to go. One of the biggest challenges any team will face in the Wiregrass is stopping Ian Sin. But to the Bears, it's all about trust. We just got to trust them to keep them contained and don't let them roll out. And then if he does, we just got to try to stick with our man. And this Cottonwood team has been great defensively, but there's some changes they've made on offense that Ayrton is taking note of. They're snapping it to their athletes back there and, and you know, doing some unbalanced things and put you in a bind. You, you think strong side and they run a counter back weak and they're, they're really good and then they throw the ball really well. The Purple Cats didn't start the way they wanted to this season, but it did not get them down. Definitely, we've been keeping our head up. Uh, beginning of the season was definitely a rough start. But we kept our head up, and we knew that once we figure it out, we're going to be a pretty good ball club. And they have turned out to be a pretty good ball club with the chance to knock off a second undefeated team in as many weeks. So that's great. We, we want to play every undefeated team, so we can try to knock, knock them off that undefeated board. So. But handing the Bears their first L is not really what's motivating this team. We're definitely starving. We want to win this game. And they'll give us a chance to be the first or second in the region, which would be excellent for playoffs, get host the first round. So that's definitely what we need so we can get a big crowd here at first round of playoffs. 